Hello and welcome back to Deep Rock Galactic Survivor and our, well, somewhat laid back, but also rather intense greed-like simulator here because I'm, <laughs> I'm taking way too many risks, aren't I? Yes, I certainly am. Anyway, these are my upgrades right now, so just so you can take a look at them, so you can see what we're all about. And what we're going to do is our first hazard three run this is going to be pretty harsh i have to take the scout here because i need to get the voltaic stun sweeper i think the scout is the only one that can use this weapon but i'm obviously not entirely sure but we're going to be using this particular class mod as well in my opinion this is really really fun i think this should be great but <laughs> I've never used it before, so I'm not sure. <laughs> Maybe it's going to be bad. Maybe it's going to be really bad. Anyway, um, we're just going to very quickly get this. I'm going to very fast try to activate the supply drone. The supply drone is going to be one of the most important things that I, I, I need to go for. I literally almost need to go for it just because it's going to give me that wonderful Nitra artifact. And that is going to be the big deal. That is going to be a huge... Wow, okay. I'm just getting murdered. I'm just getting absolutely murdered. I, it seems like I can't even mine for more kite at the moment. It seems like I'm going to have to do things the old-fashioned way. Where's 25% where's dodge chance? I've got 25% dodge chance. I should be able to not take any damage from most of these, but... Yeah, I am uh, apparently... Wow, these, th these things are really after me super bad. All right. Um, yeah, I'm not a big fan of any of these things, actually, either. I guess we'll go for reload speed. There's not much else. Wow, okay. Yeah, this is going to be really, really bad. Maybe I should have taken the other weapon. I don't know. Maybe I should have taken the other weapon. Maybe that would have been better. The GK2. Maybe that would have been a, uh, a better starting weapon. I mean, this, I don't know. This one is actually fine. I mean, it's doing a lot of damage just purely because it shoots in four directions. Um, as you can see, it shoots from behind me as well. So that's also super nice. We've got some red sugar there already. Why are we not allowed to level this thing up, by the way? You can see here that I'm not allowed to level this thing up no matter what I do. This is kind of strange. I'm not getting any level ups for it whatsoever, which is kind of weird i <laughs> i'm not entirely sure what's going on with that anyway we got the supply drone already we're going to be making our way over there let's just get this uh, we got some more I, I need i need the more kite i need one more more kite there we go complete that quest let's move on that's some good experience gain okay what else are we going to oh see now now we finally get something okay reload speed thank you all right so let me see if i can just clear out this area and this one there we go and now hopefully we can crush as many of these guys as we can. Come on, get them. Yeah, there we go. And we dodged. Nice. Okay, and there's the pickled nitro, which is exactly what we wanted. Oh, we're not getting the voltaic stun sweeper right now, but we're going to get a voltaic SMG, which I suppose is okay. That's a pretty good weapon. So why not? We'll take that to begin with. And then I'm just going to try to level that up as much as I can. I feel like that one is actually pretty good. It is a good weapon. Uh, we're just going to have to go through here, unfortunately. And, well, I guess I could just lure them into this area. I suppose that's, that's a good thing to do. You can see here we're going to be doing a lot of damage. Can we actually... Yep, there we go. Trigger the explosive bugs. Seems like that's going to be my strategy. <laughs> that's going to be my strategy in this particular run. It feels like that's literally one of the only things I can do. I haven't been able to find much nitra at all, which i got to say I'm very disappointed by. I was kind of hoping we'd be able to find quite a lot of it, but apparently not. Let's get some more max HP. Let's trigger some of these explosives. There we go. Can we get some more? Here we go. Yes, nice, nice. Okay. And, yeah, okay. Uh, hmm. I guess... Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess fire rate. Fire rate's probably pretty good. Um, yeah, so this is the Elite Acid Spitter. We've already gotten the Pickled Nitro, so I guess what I should really do is I should just try to level up as fast as I can. But the problem is leveling up fast is actually going to make things really, really difficult for me because... I'm going to eventually kill this thing. That's the problem. Plus 50% additional damage. That's actually crazy. So I took that. 
Um, yeah, let's continue leveling this as well, because we do want to get it to 12 so that we can get it overclocked. But there we go, we've already completed this level, which is actually kind of bad for me. This is not so good. Let's go for the overclock. Let's see what we can get. Release an explosion whenever the weapon reloads. I don't really care about that too much. We'll just go for the reload speed and the increased damage. That seems quite nice. Okay, I'm just going to try and get some gold here. Do is this actually worth me getting? I'm actually thinking maybe not, to be honest, because if I get the gold, what does that actually do for me? Does it do anything for me? Yeah, I can buy some additional things, but that's basically it. Uh, I, I'm kicking myself right now not about not finding more nitra, but for some reason I just wasn't able to find any. I don't know why, but there we have it. Anyway, we're going to go for 10% increased damage with things, and then we're just going to be moving on. There there we go. Uh, this Oh, it seems like a very, very hard run already, just purely because we're not getting that much nitra. But we've got some here, so that's good. And, well... We need to mine a thousand blocks of rock and stone, so I should probably end up doing that quite a bit. I need to do 200 of those per per level if I actually want to um, <laughs> if I actually want to complete the objective. That is, which I think is probably pretty important for us. And um, well, I can do that while I'm killing things, so why not? You know, I might as well. Now I do have the other objective, which is to complete what. Oh, collect 12 mushrooms, not complete. Um, but yeah, collecting 12 mushrooms is probably not going to be doable for me in this one. Uh, I, I don't think so personally, but, but maybe I am. I don't know, maybe I am able to. Oh wow, we took massive damage from that. That was not my intention. I was actually kind of hoping that we would be uh, spared that problem, but apparently not. Okay, we'll go for some more fire rate with this one. I'm just trying to get as many overclocks as possible with my Voltaic SMG. I kind of want the Stun Sweeper, please. I'm not sure why we're not getting that, but apparently we're not. But I guess, I mean, we're killing things pretty quickly as it is, so I guess that's the one thing I can be kind of pleased about. Let's try and trigger that one. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay, never mind. There is the Voltaic Stun Sweeper. Thank you very much. Okay, I will be taking that. That's wonderful. And now... Now we are in business, because that means I can now level that thing up massively, or try to level it up as much as I possibly can. And let's be very careful not to take damage here. I'm trying to be as sneaky as possible with my dodges as well. There we go, nice damage, yes. Give me all the satisfying experience, please. Okay, there we go. Thank you, and let's go for some more reload speed with this. My Voltaic Stun Sweeper needs to be leveled up to 21, by the way, which is, frankly, I think probably impossible for me. I think it is probably impossible for me in this particular run to even make it there, or to even make it close to there, because you can see here we're getting super unlucky. I'm not getting anything. I'm not getting that particular thing to level up at all, which is really, really weird. I'm not entirely sure why. Let's increase damage done by uh, for every 5 gold we have by 1%. That sounds like a decent idea. Even if it is just a small amount of percentage, it has no downside whatsoever. So even if I do spend a huge amount of gold somehow, somewhere, it doesn't really matter at all. I'm going to take the 10% increased mining speed just purely because I'm going to be doing a lot of extra mining in this level. Or shall we say, on this run. Um... I, I don't know, maybe it would have been a better idea for me to take the driller as the as the class. But the problem is, I don't think it has access to, to the Voltaic Stun Sweeper, which is the main reason why I'm playing as the scout. And we're super... Look at this. What is actually going on here? We're getting super unlucky with this right now. We're not getting anything that we really want, which is um, kind of harsh. Um, I, w I wouldn't mind some more nitra, actually. Uh, could you could you give me some more nitra, maybe? I mean, literally, I am murdering this thing like no one's business. And there you go. That is it. We are done. And now I can literally just run into these things. And they can't do anything to me. Look at that. They can literally just die. That's all they can do. I'm going to take some movement speed here because I kind of need that. Let's trigger these guys. Get them out the way. I'm actually almost dead as well because I'm getting super greedy. And I'm a bit in a rush right now. Okay, there we go. We got some magnetics. Yes, give me all that wonderful experience. 
Let's level this thing up. Let's get some luck as well so we can get some higher tier, uh, higher tier traits. And I'm going to need to heal myself, unfortunately. I'm going to need to spend 30 gold on healing myself, I believe. And I don't think I can actually spend it on anything else. I mean, a 12% reload speed is probably going to be super, super useful for us. But look at what else I can spend it on. Well, not much, right? Not much. So there's no point. Might as well just continue onward. Wow, we got really unlucky with that particular shop as well. I was kind of hoping that maybe there would be something for Nitra, even if... It is meaning that I have to spend, I don't know, 18 or 24 Nitra. That's not really that big a deal to reclaim. Usually most Nitro veins in the game are going to give you around, around that amount. So even if I were to use some, at least for a very big upgrade or a significant upgrade of some kind, that's going to be good enough, you know? That's really going to be good enough. Anyway... Ah, we've got some nitro here. Oh, of course it's in the magma veins as well. It's got the lava in between it. That's great. So I'll just loot as much as I can here. Yeah, there we go. We got 15 nitro from that. And I now have 61, which is actually pretty important. And now you see how much damage we're doing. We're doing 120, 122% uh, increased damage just from the addition of the nitro. Just from that particular artifact, not from anything else. Okay, so we've got a bunch of other things here. I think I'm probably going to be taking the... Maybe the burst fire gun shoots rapidly in four directions. I don't... Wh what's the difference between this and the other one? I don't know, but... Um, I'm probably not... I don't know. I'm probably not going to be upgrading anything else. Um, because I still have not gotten an upgrade for the Voltaic Stun Sweeper. Which I have to say I'm very surprised about. This is going to be bad. Okay, let's trigger this. Nice, nice. Ooh, that was a close one. That was a close one, if I do say so myself. But how satisfying it is for them to all explode at the same time. Amazing stuff right there. Let's go for some more reload speed. Let's go for release an explosion whenever the gun reloads. Even though, to be fair, I don't really want that. Um, <laughs> anyway, oh, 20% increased damage for electrical. That sounds great. And if I... Hmm. I need to I need to get to the supply. Uh, all right, well, this is <laughs> this is uncomfortable, isn't it? Oh dear. Okay, yeah. Now we're now we're in some problems. Yes. Now we are having some major issues. Uh, I'm gonna go for that. Hopefully, get that overclocked. But still, no upgrades for the Voltaic Stun Sweeper. What what's up with that? We're getting super unlucky. Very very unlucky in actual fact. I don't know why. Okay, let's just kill these things. Get this out the way as well. There we go. And... Oh, give me something good. Give me something good. I'm trying to dodge all this stuff as well. It's just quite... It's quite... It's quite hard, actually. It's quite hard to dodge. Oh! I just died instantly. Yeah, I took 70 damage. That was from one of those blue... Uh, blue serpent things. But yeah, I was getting really unlucky anyway. So I'm actually kind of pleased that the, the run ended a bit... Um, bit earlier than anticipated. But that is Hazard 3. That's really quite harsh. I'm not sure. Is it actually possible for me to get, to get the Voltaic Stun Sweeper with something else? Is it possible for me to get it with the Engineer, potentially, maybe? Or something like that? I don't think so somehow. I think the scout is the only one that has it available. So I think what I'm actually going to do this time... I'm not sure whether I should go for this. Uh, no, I'm going to go for the classic one because we already have the overclock unlocked. If I want to unlock the overclock for the other one, I'm probably going to play on a lower... Um, a lower hazard level. Because it makes no sense for me right now to literally just... You know play on hazard three with an un overclocked weapon that just doesn't make any sense to me so i'm gonna just go for that because the gk2 is a really good weapon later on down the line when you have some nice overclocks for it and i don't really see the point in us trying to struggle needlessly if you know what i mean because let's face it if i am early on in the game and i don't get the ability to get the stun sweeper you know super early or whatever then I would much prefer to just do it the old-fashioned way and just go for overclocks really early on with the GK2 and just see what happens after that. Um, because as it stands right now, I don't know whether the Sun Sweeper is actually going to be 
um, you know, acquirable really early. And I don't really want to take that chance because otherwise we're going to be underpowered, you see? And you need to stay ahead of the curve when it comes to this game. That's the whole point. You know, I've been playing it for a long, long time now. Well, maybe not a long, long time, but I have no idea. According to Steam, I can't even see my Steam window right now. So unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to tell you how long I've been playing it. But I've been playing it for a, a, quite a while. Uh, more than five hours total at least. Maybe me, maybe ten. I don't know. I mean, I'm not sure. Uh, it's quite, quite a long time. But look, look at this. I can actually re-roll. Let me re-roll real quick. Okay, let me re-roll again. Uh, are you serious? Re-roll again. See, now this is exactly what I'm talking about. You see exactly what just happened right here? It didn't give me the stun sweeper even after I re-rolled three times. And that just goes to show. That just shows exactly what is going on there. It's just RNG. It's RNG just messing me up right here. So, unfortunate that that is indeed going to be the thing that might actually ruin the run. Um, obviously, I do want to complete the run itself. But... Am I even going to be able to? That's the question. Will I be even able to complete the run if I, I if I, 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 I don't know. I mean, yeah, sure, I will be able to, but the Stun Sweeper was definitely going to help us out a great deal in actual fact, because it is a good weapon. Don't get me wrong, it is an absolutely fantastic weapon. And now I'm kind of sad that we have this other thing right here, even though this other thing is actually not even terrible. It's actually a pretty good one, but yeah, anyway, we're going to take this, even though this only gives me 20% um, increased damage. Which is not very good, all things considered. I'm actually going to have to run away. Not something I wanted to do. Let's just trigger the explosive bugs. There we go. Nice. Level this up. Trigger that one. Even though I've got to be a bit careful of this. There we go. Okay. Just try and be a little bit, a little bit dodgy. A little bit dodgy. You know. We've got to be super careful about getting hit by any of those bigger enemies. And there we have it. Okay. We're just going to clear out the explosives down there. Then we can actually move over there instead of us having to be worried about uh, the play space in and around this area. And now we have the... Oh, there's actually a magnet on the floor there. Hmm. I would like to go and pick that up, but uh, the problem is I need, I need nitra, okay? I need some nitra, so I am running away very purposefully trying to find nitra rather than anything else. I don't really care about anything else right now. Oh, I literally just almost killed myself as well with that explosion. I was kind of not expecting it to be so large, the explosive radius of that particular thing, but okay. It's just, oh wow, okay. Am I gonna die very, very fast here? I think so. Okay, Wait, what is this? Oh, it's an acid spitter, okay, yeah. This is, oh, I almost died. I almost died. Okay, that was really, really uh, close, actually. Okay, let's go for this. What's this? Change the damage type to cold. Do I want cold damage or do I want uh, damage and reload speed? I'm thinking cold damage right now, actually. Okay, let's run. Get it. Run away, sir. Run away. I need you to run very quickly, uh, Mr. Scout. Thank you. And the enemies are going to grow stronger, so I need to be very careful of this. I can't actually mine through anything, so I'm going to have to kill this explosive bug. Try not to get myself killed in the meantime. And I'm going to have to make a really large detour around this entire huge wave. I'm going to take some damage from the lava, but that is to be expected. Hopefully I will be able to avoid these enemies. Oh no, I'm dead. Oh no, I'm not! I'm alive! I am alive! Okay, here we go. Okay, now I, all I need to do is do this. Not that. Mm. I was kind of hoping that I could get a little bit closer. Oh well, never mind. Okay, let's just go through here real fast. Okay, this is oh, this is super bad, actually. <laughs> this is so bad. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. I might actually get something going here. Okay, here we go. Let's try and kill this thing. It's an acid spitter, so I have to be very careful. Oh no. Uh, I dodged it! I dodged it! I think I probably would have died from that! Okay, wait a minute. I think I'm dead, actually. I think I'm dead. Just purely because I, I've just not been... I've not been doing a very good job in this one. I really haven't. Okay, don't get killed, sir. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm being very level-headed right now, even though technically I should be panicking like no one's business, but... I am actually being very careful. These things are literally wanting to murder me so badly right here. 
I wish I had some explosive bugs. Oh yeah, there you go. Wow. Hazard 3 is hard. It feels really, really hard. Is it just because I'm trying to do this mission? Maybe it's because I'm trying to do the mission. Or maybe I should try something a little bit different. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna try this. We're gonna go for... I feel I feel like I don't want to give up. Okay, I don't want to give up. So we're gonna we're gonna do it again with this scout, and I'm gonna try my hardest here. Okay, and not that I wasn't trying hard before, but I'm gonna try a little bit more to be strategic about how I want to do things. And we're not gonna try to re-roll super stupidly for the stun sweeper, even though I personally felt like that wasn't particularly stupid. But it didn't really work out for us too well, did it? So. We're just going to try to complete the side objective really, really quickly. And then we're going to go on from there. But Hazard 3, I've not tried it before. This is the first time you've been seeing it in this very episode. So obviously, I'm not practiced at it in any way, shape, or form. I can complete Hazard 2 relatively consistently now. But Hazard 3 is a completely different, completely different case. It's certainly not something that I was expecting to be easy. But I was kind of thinking, hey, you know what? I might be okay because we've been doing some good good work, you know? On Hazard 2, we're pretty solid, you know? We're not having too many issues with that. But with this one, oh yeah, we certainly have. So I'm just going to try and get the gold here. Try to kill these loot bugs as well. And then I'm going to get away from here as fast as I can. So I'm just going to go this way. Because this is also a, this is also the kind of strategy that you want to try to have. Where you just try to keep the environment you know a little bit like separating you and the enemies because that's also going to be a thing that will help you out a great deal so there we go we've done that that's nice now oh no, oh look who it is look who it is the voltaic stun sweeper immediately yes thank you finally that's exactly what i wanted okay great so now we're now we're actually doing all right now we're going to go down and we're going to get this um this supply beacon and I will try to get it really, really fast. Oh, explosives in the way? Are you serious? Wow, I can't believe that they put explosives right next to the supply beacon. What a crazy, crazy thing that is. Okay, well, we'll just get this down here and we'll just select... Oh, wow, that's absolutely awful. Oh, dear. Okay. Ah... Uh... Ah, uh, no, this is awful. XP scanner, I guess. This is absolutely terrible. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to just do this, well, as I say, the old-fashioned way. Because usually what I would like to do is pick up the, uh, the pickled nitro artifact. Because, of course, that's the thing that's actually going to enable us to do massive damage or to do more damage than we would otherwise be able to. I'd be able to do 48% increased damage now. But unfortunately, I wasn't able to get that because, of course, it is slightly RNG. You know, you got to be aware of that. I'm going to go this way. And I'm going to just bait the explosives into, you know, exploding. Boom. <laughs> yeah, that's what I like to see. All right, let's level up the Voltaic Stun Sweeper a huge amount. I want to level that up as much as I possibly can. And anything else that we can overclock, that's basically it. So the Voltaic Stun Sweeper is everything that I will... I will always prioritize the Stun Sweeper every single time I see it. Um, uh, wow, we're getting pretty unlucky about this. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of that. Okay, well, let's just explode that thing. Uh, what else can we do here? Well, I can just pick up the experience, of course. Ah, there we go. Okay, this is actually quite nice. Now I can change the damage to electrical, which is kind of what I wanted to do initially anyway, so that I can actually start synergizing our build to use the same damage type. That's kind of the thing that I was hoping for here. Got to go for critical chance. I personally prefer critical chance over other things, even though reload speed is obviously extremely important. I am going to be getting quite a lot of that later down the line. Is this thing actually going to die or am I just am I just asking it to just stick around for tea or what? Because this thing is literally super super difficult apparently. Um yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of wondering what's going to happen with this. Cuz the aliens are going to grow stronger and eventually they'll be in a position to one-shot me like they were beforehand, so I'm actually quite worried. 
Um, I can level this up once again to five, which would probably be a good idea. And then next level, I might be able to get some really cool things going on, like a nice little overclock with it. Okay, so we got some wonderful explosions going on here. That doesn't really do much for me, unfortunately. I will try to kill this thing to try and get some HP back. And then, yes! Yes, the explosive bugs are right here. This is perfect. Boom, there we go. There we go, that's what we like. Okay, I'm gonna have to go through here. I am gonna take some damage, unfortunately, but hopefully it's gonna, uh, yeah, there we go. I did manage to survive. Okay, here we go, here we go. I'm trying to funnel them into a bottleneck, you see. That's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm trying to funnel them into a bottleneck so that my stun sweeper can just literally penetrate through all of them and do massive damage. That's kind of all I'm hoping for here. Okay, this thing's gonna gonna die soon in just a moment. Die, please. Die, please. Oh, are you joking? Are you serious right now? <laughs> is it is it joking? <laughs> is it? <laughs> Why? Why is it doing this to me? Why is it doing this? Okay, well, whatever. Uh, let's just go this way then. There we go. It's dead finally. Go, 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 go. Okay, I can't pick up the experience. I'm sorry. I just literally cannot pick up the experience. I'm going to have to just get out of here. I would love to pick up the experience, but I cannot. And let's have a look. What else can I go for? <laughs> I guess I'll go for the M1000. Or should I go for more electrical damage? Uh, sure. I'll go for more electrical damage. Why not? Uh, I'm not. I don't know. I'm not a big fan. I, I, I got to say, I'm actually not a big fan of the electrical damage. To be honest, I feel like acid is my favorite, and then fire followed followed by that, um, and then everything else after that, which is obviously electrical. Okay, so weapon range. I'm probably going to go for weapon range here. Um, that's kind of what I want to go for, and we're going to go for critical chance with electrical weapons. I mean, yeah, we've got all electrical weapons right now, so that's obviously great. Let's go for some more experience gain, and then I guess we could probably go for more damage with this, or we could re-roll, and then we could try to get something else. I guess I'll try to re-roll. Ah, look at that. We've got some more damage with our stun sweeper, which I think is quite nice, so we'll do that, and then we could also go for max HP. That sounds pretty good. Okay, so we've used basically all of our resources. Obviously, we don't have the pickled nitro right now, so we do have to make the most of pretty much every single little bit of resource we have, because this is indeed, as I say, hazard three. We've got to be... I know, I know it's obviously not very high level in comparison to the total of the game, because I think there are... How many hazard levels? Six? Five? I don't know. There's quite a lot, so... You know, thinking about doing that... Um, and this is already difficult. Well, I have no idea how that's going to be. It's going to be quite harsh, isn't it? Anyway, I'm just going to very quickly make a very sneaky tunnel through the middle here and just try to get this nitra without spooking people too much. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay. No, get, get out of here. Get out of there. Get out of there, you idiot. Ah, oh, run. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, just stop for a loot bug. Yep, yeah, get out of here. Run. Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I am gonna die like nothing else. There is not much I can do about that. I just literally got stopped so hard. Wow. Um, yeah. I'm probably dead. Uh, I know for certain that there is some red sugar down here somewhere, right? Where is it? Where is it? I don't know where it is. I'm sorry. I don't know where it is. I think we're gonna die here. I think we're dead. Um, there's not much I can do about it, unfortunately. I would like to be able to do something. No, no, no. Okay, run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get out of there. Get out of there. <gasps> okay, I'm actually alive. I am actually alive. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? I cannot. Okay, come on now. Come on now. We can live. We can live. Just kill that thing. Yes. Okay, don't step on that. I've only got 10 HP. Okay. Oh, well. I, I, no, I, I've, I've forgotten where the red sugar is, you see. That's the main problem here. Okay, I'm just going to lure all these guys to come over here. Oh, they, they are moving way too fast for my liking. Okay, yeah, I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm alive. Amazingly. How am I alive still? I don't know. 
Okay, I'm gonna just go all the way out of here. I'm just gonna get out of here. I'm just gonna run. I am just gonna run. And I will try, if I can, to find some red sugar. Uh, you know what's really funny, though? As soon as you need red sugar, it's nowhere to be seen. Have you noticed that? It's so funny. Alright, uh... <laughs> Fire rate for this thing, I guess. Ah, here we go. We've got some red sugar. I might actually be able to survive. Hmm. Nice. Yes. Thank you. All right. Well, that's a little bit better. Not great, but a little bit... No! No, no! Oh, okay. Whew. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Kill these. Kill these. Kill these. Kill these. Kill these. Come on now. Come on, scout. Kill them. Kill them. Yes. There we go. All right, that's what we like. That's what we like. Okay, let's go for fire aid here. I'm almost... Okay, I just need to level up one more time. I just need to level up one more time. And I just need to get the wondrous, wondrous edition of uh, one more level in my GK2. And then we should be absolutely fantastic. Then we should be great. Where's my supply drone, by the way? Did you see that? Where is... Oh, it, oh yeah, we passed by it. And now I'm, now I'm totally screwed because it's so far away. I'm going to have to kill this thing. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much I can do about that, unfortunately. I literally just have to do it. I have to go through here as well. I'm going to die from these, aren't I? Or maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, I'm going to die from the explosives because I'm so terrible. Oh, my. Yes, that sounds like a plan. Okay, don't get killed by those stabby stab things. Okay, I'm just going to try and pick up as much of this as I can. Oh, no. Really? Are, are you serious? No, no. You're not going to kill me, sir. No, no. Oh, oh. Hello. Hello. We might be able to do this. There it is. There's the kill. Okay. There's the kill. Unfortunately, I can't actually go back there, though. Do you see that? I, I literally cannot go back there right now. going to reroll a bunch of times. 15% oh, additional damage. Sure. Why not? I can't go back there because look at, look at what's happening. I'd love to pick up the supply drone, but I just cannot. Oh, that is so sad. Literally, the amount of enemies that are there. But I did kill the enemy boss, which is all that I really wanted to do with the supply drone coming down, dropping on his head. That was insane, if I, if, I, if I do say so myself. You know, that was not too bad, not too bad. Anyway, I am basically just going to heal myself right now, and then I'm going to re-roll and see if I can maybe find something good. Like, for example, this is actually... Oh, this is actually fantastic. Going to be taking this. There we go. That's absolutely wonderful. That means that my stun sweeper is close to level now. And um, we also have GK2 almost leveled as well. So that's really, really good. I've mined 600 blocks of rock and stone just by just by playing, really. Just literally by playing, not by doing anything else, which is actually quite funny. And oh, wow. We're being attacked from every single direction right now. So I'm just going to go through the easiest possible route. And let's see what I can do here. I'm literally just going to stand here for the moment. And I'm just going to try to grind as much experience as I can from these small enemies before the elites turn up. As you can see, we've got some elites already coming. And we're just going to get these little bits of nitra. Okay, run away. Run! Run, sir. Dodge. Thank you. Ooh -hoo. Dodge saving me right now. That was a fantastic dodge, sir. Very nice. Okay, yeah. Just bait this into... Okay, uh, yeah, we'll go for this, I guess. <laughs> I suppose. Or target the enemy with the highest HP. Uh, no, I'll go for this, I guess. Let's just bait that into an explosion. Nice. Clear the way. Thank you, sir. Let's get out of there. This thing is going to kill me in one hit, or almost kill me in one hit, so I should be a bit careful of going close to them. And let's try to be a bit careful. Let's try to get some of these explosive guys dead. Nice. Yes. There we go. Another one? Yep. Another one exploded. Nice. Nice. I am getting a little bit hit, but that is uh, to be expected. I mean, technically, if I was a little bit better, I might be able to avoid damage. But, well, it's me, so I do tend to take damage quite often. Okay, let me just try to get through here if at all possible. More nitro is always good. Okay, more reload speed for this thing. I'd like to get the armor, but I, I have to get overclocks, because if you don't kill things, well, 
let's just say you're you're dead in the water, basically, then. You know, if you don't kill stuff. Oh, no. Oh, oh, I, oh, I, oh, I can't believe it. I cannot believe that, actually. Well, actually, I can. Never mind. I can believe it, because um, basically what happened there? Did you see what happened? I was walking into an explosive, and then at the last moment, I noticed that I was walking into the explosive, and then I decided, oh, yes, let me run away and not run, uh, you know, close to that. Yeah, that was really, really harsh. Okay. Well, hmm. This is literally the only thing I can actually do. Okay, you know what? I'm going to play as the driller this time. And we'll play as the classic driller. And we're just going to get the, the side objective done. And we'll see. Maybe maybe we're going to actually get something cool here. Maybe we're going to be able to actually complete the run. I'm going to go for this one more run. And then we'll see what happens. Because obviously, you know, I, I usually end episodes after, you know, two or three runs. Because I just feel like that's kind of like a nice nice duration. It's not too short, it's not too long, you know, sort of thing. But I don't know. I, I'm I, I'm 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 annoyed. I'm a, I'm a little bit annoyed. And I want to try to, you know, at least do something. At least get something completed, if you know what I mean. And so I'm kinda hoping that maybe we'll be able to do something here with the driller, because maybe I'll be able to just at least complete the mining objective. I won't be able to do the stun sweeper of course. Okay, so I'm just going to try to mine as much as I possibly can here. Obviously, I'm going to try to pick up more kite and so on. Uh, I'm going to watch out for the supply drone, of course, as well. More experience gain is always good. Okay, here we go. So what do we want to go for? Do we want to go for the... Uh, I guess we'll go for the, the turrets, right? The turret seems relatively decent. I think that's quite nice. And we're just going to mine through absolutely everything that we can. But we've got to be careful, though, as well, because you can't actually mine through everything on the level. Because if you do that, it's going to basically corner you into a scenario where enemies are just going to be able to surround you instantly. And it's going to be very easy for them to kill you at that point. And so that's the reason why I'm being a bit careful in terms of mining everything. Um, so I'm, I am creating some paths, and I am being a little bit more uh, liberal with what I'm, you know, digging through and everything, but yeah, I'm not being super, uh, super crazy with it. Anyway, let's just get rid of all this. There we go. Nope, almost. Yeah, there we are. Nice. Okay, now we can actually kill this elite with the supply drop. Hopefully. Yep, there you go. And now we can get this. And what are we getting? Uh, I actually feel like I want to get a small chance to find nitro when mining any kind of rock. I think that sounds absolutely fantastic. We'll go for reload speed on the turret as well. I think that sounds pretty cool too. And now I just have to be a bit careful here. I will try to get the nitro. And not the nitro. The red sugar. And we're going to take some damage from the explosion. But that's absolutely fine. Let's go for some more reload speed for our main weapon here. Because this main weapon, when overclocked into an acid damaging ability, it is amazing. It is absolutely fantastic. Probably one of my favorite weapons. And I never would have expected to say that. Because this weapon um, only shoots behind me, and I really do not like that, actually. I'm not a big fan of that ever. But it has proven itself to be extremely effective in the past. Okay, we've got to be careful here. Okay, I'm just going to try to get the gold as well, if I can. Try to get this stuff. I'm being really greedy right now, actually. I'm being super, super greedy, but this weapon that I have right here, firing in, uh, firing uh, to our back, is actually super, super good. i uh, change the damage type to fire. I don't want it to do that, actually. I hate that. I'm actually a really, really um, big opponent of fire damage for this weapon. I don't think it's actually that good, but maybe it is actually going to do well here. I don't know. But as you can see, look at how much damage we're actually able to do with this thing. Look at how much easier this level is with the driller and its abilities. You know, it's just so, so simple in comparison to the other one where the scout is just, for some reason, not able to do that much. Even though, funnily enough, in the, in the previous episodes, I've been saying to you very specifically, hey, you know what? Every single class is viable in some respect or another. And I'm, st I'm, I'm going to still stand by that, okay? I'm still going to stand by that, but I actually feel like maybe... Maybe that's not even the case. I don't know. Because the scout, as it stands, I personally feel is... 
I think it is still the weakest, but I definitely feel like it has a place in the game. Obviously, it definitely has a place in the game, but it feels much weaker than the driller, for example, because the driller has just been absolutely amazing. As you've seen right here, we were able to complete that level without too many issues. Yeah, sure, we were about to die at the end there. Did you see that? I don't know whether you saw that, but yeah, we were about to take fatal damage at the end. We lived with like five HP or something, but look at how easy we were able to complete 500 blocks worth of mining just because obviously the driller is very much designed for that particular objective. But I didn't, that's the thing. I didn't actually think that it would be difficult to complete that objective. And uh, even as the scout, I actually thought it would be easy as the scout. Um, but apparently not. Apparently I was having some huge, um, I don't know, huge issues in general just with the with the entire thing. So it seems like I needed to, I don't know, get a reality check or something because apparently the scout just isn't, isn't designed for that. I mean, obviously it's not designed for that, but I was kind of hoping it would be slightly better than it ended up being, which is somewhat sad I guess but oh well never mind it doesn't really matter too much right now we just have to concentrate on staying alive here ah there we go I almost got I almost got murdered almost got murdered but thankfully I didn't not this time around at least let's just get through here get all this stuff thank you okay what do we have here reload speed yeah we'll just go for that we've got some more nitro here as well which is obviously pretty nice let's just step on this thing get some explosives going on there Got to be a bit careful of these. Where's where's red sugar, by the way? Can we can we get some? <laughs> can we can we find some, please? Can we find some red sugar? Oh my! We can maybe find the. Um, well, we could, we've got the more kite. Ah, there we go. More red sugars down there. Fantastic. Okay, this is good. This is good. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm taking massive damage from uh, the uh, acid spitter right there. Okay, there we go. We've healed ourselves a little bit. Not that much. There's the supply beacon. Okay, so if we can get the Nitra artifact, I feel like we might be okay. I might actually be able to um, win, kind of. But if I can't, oh wow, this is actually really bad. Huh. Well, there's some, there's some cleansing right there. Okay, nice. Okay. Whew. What are we doing? What are we doing? Uh, I guess we'll get this. There we go. Nice. Okay. Are we going to get it? We didn't? Oh. Oh. Ah. Well. Um. There you go. <laughs> I guess that's I guess that's it then. I guess that's it. There, there's nothing I can do. You know, we're uh, we're probably gonna die just because we don't have that. Anyway, I'll go for the wave cooker because, as I say, I personally like the wave cooker a whole bunch. I think it's a super super nice weapon. And uh, yeah, okay. Um, well, let's see what I can do here. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go through this way and this guy yeah just try to avoid getting killed okay i've actually got some pretty decent hp right now so all i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna lead these guys through bottlenecks as much as i can and we're just gonna continue firing at the elite slasher because this guy is not gonna stop he's literally just gonna walk in a straight line he's just gonna w towards me basically and um he doesn't really have anything special that he does so i'm, I'm not too afraid of him right now and technically what I could do is I could spend this time going around here and picking up some experience. So I think that might make sense. Let's just trigger this guy. There we go. And yeah, he's dead. Okay, so that's actually really good. Let's just try and trigger some of these explosives. Can we kill these or no? I don't think we can actually. That's kind of sad. Okay, so we're going to have to go for the increased clip size. Uh, are we done? Yeah, we're done. Okay, so now I just need to move, but the problem is... Trigger that. There we go. Trigger this. Nice. Good experience. Come on, gimme, gimme, gimme. Okay, run. No! Are you serious? Oh, you see exactly what I'm talking about, though. That is hard. That is very, very difficult. Was I not able to get even close? To how, how, how much did I... How much did I mine? I don't actually know how much I mined. Oh well. 
Ma oh, really? Oh, I can't believe it. I, I don't want to end right now. I don't want to end because I feel like I haven't done anything. Okay, you know what? We're going to do the driller again. I'm going to... I'm going to try the interrogator this time. Okay? I'll see you on level 2. Alright, so there you go. I made it to stage 2. <laughs> oh, with 11 HP. Yes. With 11 HP. Really bad, right? Yeah, really bad. Okay, so we're going to just take the paint job real fast so that we can get this. And then we can just get the plus 1 beam. I think the plus 1 beam is better than the plus 100% damage. I think so. Uh, but obviously it's up to interpretation. I think plus one beam is better, but maybe you don't. I don't know. But you can just take it in your own game if you want to, and then you can see how it is, and then you can tell me, you know, you can tell me what's better. Anyway, let's see if I can actually complete stage two. This is obviously quite the challenge. I've decided to take the wave thing um, pretty early on in this one. And I'm hopeful that that's going to make a bit of a difference. I also have the nitrogenic dust, which um, I'm, I'm going to increase beam width. Um, yeah, which actually makes it that I gain critical chance, 0.5% critical chance for every nitra I have. So if I have huge amounts of nitra, then I'll gain even more critical chance. And that's what I want. So I'm actually just going to stand here. And I'm going to use my microwave thing uh, to do as much damage as I can through the rock. I mean, you can see here, look at look at how much damage I can do through the rock right now. Um, and uh, it's actually doing pretty nice, uh, surprisingly enough. And um, yeah, I, I can then make an escape route back here. And then I might be able to get away. <laughs> might being the operative word there. I don't know whether I'll be able to, but I should hopefully be able to. And then what we'll do is we'll go down here. There's nitro there actually, which I wouldn't mind getting, but I don't want to be too greedy. So let's just go this way. Get these guys to explode. Thank you. Let's get these guys, get all this experience. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to go for the, uh, for the turret, I guess. I kind of wanted the acid thing, but we're not getting lucky in that regard. So that's fine. Not that big a deal. Just explode that guy. Thank you. Give me this. Oh, wow. I'm at 1 HP. Oh, well, that's great, isn't it? That's wonderful. Ah, uh, I, I shouldn't have even bothered doing another run, should I? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I am so dead. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, actually, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Maybe I'm not. Oh, oh, hello. Hello. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, wait, don't give up, don't give up just yet. Don't give up just yet. We might be able to still do something. Uh, oh, no, this is this is interesting. This is interesting. Okay, I wasn't expecting this. I certainly wasn't expecting this. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> okay, this is going to be interesting. <laughs> all right, let me get this. There we go, give me that, give me that. Yeah, give me all that wonderful HP, thank you. Okay, kill these things, please. Kill these things. Yep. There we go. Kill them. Kill them. Kill, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kill them all. Kill them all. Come on now. Come on. Yes. Yes. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Thank you very much. Okay. So I'm going to go for critical chance because it, that seems like the build we're going for right now. Critical chance seems to be the name of the game. I'm going to go for reload speed though. We're going to try to level this thing up a little bit if we can. I have some HP now, but unfortunately that's not going to be enough. Oh, this is a slasher. It, they would give me a slasher at this moment in time, wouldn't they? That's really, really bad for me, actually, because a slasher right now is basically making it so that I have to consistently run away instead of being able to sort of chill a little bit and let the damage over time do its do its work. Because obviously that's the whole point of fire, isn't it? That's the whole point. Um, yeah, so I'm now going to not see where enemies are either because of the graphics. Um, and then I'm just going to get myself hit over and over again. And we're probably going to end up dying as a result. But who knows? Maybe I will surprise us both. Or maybe I'll just run into the fire and just kill myself. I don't know. Either one. <laughs> Either one. Oh, there we go. We actually killed the... What? We killed the main guy? Oh, okay. We killed the main guy somehow. 
I have no idea how that happened, but apparently we did it. Can I do this? Oh, no. Nope. 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 <laughs> I wish. Don't get me wrong. I want that. I want that supply drone right now, but no. No, it's just not going to happen, unfortunately. Okay, so increased damage. Insane damage, actually. 50% increased damage. Going to have to take that. The lifetime of the beams, that sounds pretty good too. But unfortunately, I feel like I should probably heal myself. I did not want to do that, but I had to. I know. I know. It's painful for me as well. Yes, indeed. Okay, so let's have a look-see here. Let's try and find some more nitra so that I can do more critical... Reach 75% critical chance. Oh, that's one of the things that I can potentially do. Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of cool. Maybe I'll be able to. I don't know. Maybe maybe I will? I don't know. It's unlikely now, isn't it? Because I had a, a huge amount of nitro, but it's really unlikely now because we only have 20, so... It's probably not going to happen. But... Uh, oh, now, now I'm kind of kicking myself, but I kind of wanted to get those things, but... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Sometimes it's worth it, you know? Sometimes it's worth it to go for those things, go for those little small upgrades. Maybe I shouldn't have. Oh, this is going to be bad. Me walking into these acid slime throwing things. More explosives going off as well, which is fine, I suppose. Let's just drop some turrets. Make it a little easier for me to get away. Oh, really? I took 55 damage from something? What did I take 55 damage from? I have no idea what. But it was something. Ugh. Okay. We're fine. I'm going to go back down here because I know that we have some red sugar available in this direction. There it is. Yes, there we go. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Where's the supply drone? Did it already get dropped? Yes, it did. Where is it? Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's the supply drone? I don't see it. I can't make the map larger, can I? I don't think I can make the, make the map larger. Oh, there it is. It's up there. Okay. Let's go that way then. Oh, no. I want to get the nitro so badly. Okay, let's just go. Go, 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 go. Don't, don't take damage. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. Okay, we're fine. We are fine. We are fine right now. <laughs> Next thing you know, I'll be saying, we're not fine. We're not fine. Yeah, no, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. We're fine right now. Nice. Okay, Whew. Okay. what do we want? What do we want? We want 70 max HP plus 2 region, right? Yeah, we're taking that. Look at that. Look at our HP now. We're doing a lot better than we were before. We're going to have to go through these, even though they're going to do damage to me. This is literally the only thing that I can do to escape. And we're doing massive damage on enemies as we run. No, no, don't take damage from these things. Run. Okay, don't take damage. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. Yes, yes. Fine, fine. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. And now we just have to kill the elite Praetorian. I have no idea where this thing is. Don't take damage from those little things, please. Come on now, don't do that. Okay, so, yeah, more damage for this. Oh, yeah, more experience. Oh, yeah, that's what we want. Okay, 30% uh, pickup radius. I think I'll probably... No I, no, I can't take that. I really want to, but I can't take that. Okay, what do we want here? Uh, I guess I'll just go for the quick-firing weapon, even though the other things are probably a little bit better for me right now. Um, they don't have any overclocks, so that's the problem. So, even though I probably won't be going for overclock at all, but I think this weapon is actually pretty good. So, let's try and explode these things. Nice. Nice. Yes. Give me more. Give me more experience, please. Okay, here we go. Uh, hmm, what do I do? I guess I'll go down this way. Take damage from the magma a little bit. Can I go through here? Because <laughs> apparently that's the only way I can go. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. Oh, the explosions. Yes. Yes. More explosions, please. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Got to be careful here. Yes, I just had to move away from that explosive. Because otherwise I would have died. Okay, here we go. Not too bad. Reload speed and boom, we've got this. This is absolutely amazing. Okay, we are going to have to go 
for the balanced overclock. Less initial damage, but increases the applied burn stacks. Okay, kill the elite Praetorian. Where is he? I don't even know. Oh, there he is. He's right on top of me. Okay, that's great. <laughs> yeah, that's a fantastic, fantastic thing, isn't it? Okay, yeah. So he's going to die relatively quickly, I think. As long as he keeps running after me. Oh, no. Run! Run! Run, sir! Yes, there we go. We did the objective. Okay, that's all that I wanted. There we are. We did the objective. So if I die now, then everything is going to be good. Okay? Everything's going to be fine. Because we will have unlocked Hazard 3 for the other level, which is cool. And um, maybe I'll be able to do that. I don't know. Oh no, I literally got hit by one of those. Are you serious? Uh, yeah, that, that killed me right there. Me getting hit by one of those green uh, green slime things that travel through the air, that's what killed me. It wasn't actually anything else. I would have been able to survive if I hadn't got hit by that. But there you have it. Anyway, I did actually gain some things. Let's go for some more um, mining speed, I guess. Mining speed's pretty important. And yeah, look at this. We unlocked Hazard 3, and it says here, upgrade the BRT-7 burst fire gun to level 21, but also collect 500 gold. Okay, so one thing. Let me have a look here. Where is the BRT? Where is that? Where is the BRT rifle or whatever it is? Let's have a look. We can actually have a look on here to actually see exactly what's going on. So where where is that? The BRT-7. There it is. Okay, so it's a gunner weapon. The BRT burst fire gun. Okay, so it's a gunner weapon. So in other words, I have to play the I have to play that and probably unlock it. I'm going to assume. And uh, yeah, then we'll then we'll see. Dodge 100 times during a dive. That sounds pretty harsh. Mm -hmm, yeah, reach class ra rank 18. That's the demolitionist mod. Okay, there's not that much that I have to unlock still. Quite funnily enough, but mm, there are going to be some really important things that we go for here. So I think what I'll have to do is I will have to play. Well, I'm going to play probably Hazard 2 on one of these levels. Probably Hazard 2 on this one because I haven't actually completed this, as you can see. So this one would probably be really useful for us. And then we'll be able to um, level up the gunner's weapon, the BRT thing. And uh, yeah, you can see here that I don't start with that, which is somewhat unfortunate. But I should be able to level it up relatively easily. And I'll do that in my own time so you don't have to watch that or anything. But otherwise, I thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time.